Do you remember this wintery related Roblox simulator game? Not many people do, but it's about to get a full revamp. Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. Yo, what's going on, guys? It's Russo, and welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a fantastical day. I know I am, because today we're revisiting the past, okay? This game, actually, the fact that this game was big so long ago, before I even had simulators on my channel, I didn't even play games like this, and I didn't even know what I was doing, honestly, with my channel. I don't even remember. Um, but this game is so legendary to the Roblox Simulator community. Now, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, it's this game right here, Snow Shoveling Simulator. That's right. This game was made uh, in 2017, so it's about a year old this year. It's actually almost a year old exactly. It was created 12-17-2017. And it's almost the anniversary for this game. And I think that on the anniversary of this game, they're going to release it. I'm, I'm assuming that's what they're going to do. Um, and But what I mean by release it is release the new revamped version of this game. I have a lot of tweets and info to go over by the owner of this game, but before we do that, if you guys are hyped for this video and some news about this new simulator dropping soon, smash that like button down below. Hit that like button and let's see if we get to 2,705 million likes. Ring, ring. Oh, sorry, I'm getting a call, guys. Hello? Oh, okay. Oh, that was just the president of the United States telling you to subscribe to my channel today and join the Blue Crew. Hit that notification bell, ding, to never miss an upload, guys. I upload two videos every single day and they're bangers join the blue crew today also guys if you didn't already see my dope blue crew merch is in roblox now look at this it looks amazing i honestly love it in roblox so much and it's in real life if you guys want to cop it in either roblox or in real life go check out the links in the description and join the blue crew group now let's get into this stuff okay about this game because this game was made by lotterman 23 this is the owner of virtual block studio which is the game studio that made this game and this game like I said, came out a year ago. Now, I don't have a lot of people that were subscribed back then, okay? A lot of you guys are new to the channel, which I'm so grateful for. And we have a big following now, all right? And a lot of you guys might not know about this game. I mean, you might, but this game was huge. When it first came out, it was dominating for like a couple months, even when it wasn't even snowing. Like it was dominating in like February. It was, it lasted so long. And this game kind of redefined how simulators are today. And there's been so many simulators this year, so many games since then that have used like tactics and, and, and things from this game. And they're revamping. He's been talking about a revamp for a really long time. And he said this, fan, when is the snow shoveling simulator update coming? Me, soon, fan. <sighs> That's literally me. That's actually what I'm doing right now. But I am so excited because this game is gonna get a full revamp apparently. Look at this. He's adding like flamethrower guns. What is this? What is this gun? Is it a giant? It looks like a red water gun, honestly, but it's probably a giant flamethrower. I'm super excited to see the new like revamp version of this game. I don't know if they're gonna revamp like all of the models or like the builds. I hope we get a full revamp of the game and it just feels like a brand new game, but I don't know what it's happening. I'm assuming if it doesn't happen in the next few days, it's gonna happen on 12, 17, 2018, which is a year from their anniversary last year. And of course he says, don't like the default tool colors. That's fine, get creative. So you can color your tools. Like, I guess you can paint your own tools now and they're probably gonna add a lot of new tools, the, the flamethrower, and I am just so excited. Again, if you guys are hyped, smash that like button. But basically my title is like, Something about only 99% of people know about this game or only click this if you know this game. A lot of people don't know this game. And I wanna show you guys some of the cool stuff that I've gathered in this game since I played it. I actually spent a ton of Robux on this game in one episode and uh, I purchased like a really, really expensive vehicle. So I'm hoping I still have it. If I don't, hey, I might as well just buy it again for, for you know, entertainment purposes. But let's go ahead and go to the plow shop over here. Now this game, when it first came out, I wasn't very impressed with the builds. I think the builds could be upgraded. So I'm hoping that the builds are like revamped. It is very simple, but I wanna just see some dope snow action, some dope buildings and some, I mean, the vehicles are actually kind of cool. I, I, I like the vehicles, I'll give them that. But let's go ahead in here and see if uh, we could uh, get this vehicle working. Hey, sir, how you doing? Open store. Um, what is the truck that, what is the thing that we have? Big plow. And then what else do we have? I think we have something else. <gasps> The snowmobile is what I have. And then this abominable snowmobile. Oh my gosh, and there's Darzeth. That's insane. Is that the best thing? Oh my gosh. So I have myself the big plow. I have that. The sleigh I don't have. The UFO I don't have. The grater. And then the abominable snowmobile. I kind of want to get this. I don't know 
if this is the actual best weapon or the uh, best vehicle, but I spawned it. Let's go ahead and see if we can go find this thing. Yeah, I spawned my vehicle. It should be right out here. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, sick. This is exciting. Okay, so I don't know, again, like I said, if this is the number one uh, vehicle in the game, it does cost a lot. Oh, snap, dude. This thing is insane. Are you kidding me, bro? Look how much snow I'm plowing up real fast. Oh, what's over here? What is this? Snowball fights. Oh, sick. Let's go, baby. Can I go with my vehicle? Okay, I guess I can't. Okay. <laughs> I'm kind of like breaking the game right now. Um, so this is my abominable snowmobile. This thing is actually so sick. I can't go this way with, uh, with the vehicle because I think I can only... Wait, why is the arrow pointing there still? I grabbed my car already, arrow, you weirdo. You can stop pointing now. So I can't go to the ice mountain with this vehicle. Yeah, I need the snowmobile and I already have that. I can actually ride that into ice mountain, which we'll do in a second. But um, what is the point of this game? That's a good question, random stranger. The point of this game is basically to shovel snow and uh, collect the snow, sell it to the snowman, and then you get money and you can buy dope stuff. Now, if you guys didn't play this when it was big, like I said, it was a phenomenon and it was like the first of its kind and then tons of simulators came out. So I hope that when they revamp and they've been talking about this revamp for a long time, I hope that it changes the game again because I know that this dev team's got something up their sleeves. Look how much I'm plowing, by the way. I'm already at 44,000 and I was at like 40,000 before I even got in this car, bro. This thing is like dominating, not gonna lie. Also, it'd be sick if you, oh, wait, wait, what is this? They have pets? I did not know they have pets in this game. Since when? Oh my gosh. Ants parrot. Oh my gosh. Diamond Frosty. Money bags. Otherworldly pet. Dragon. Business cat. Noob archer. Raven. Mini ice king. Mini cave creature. Mini maniacal cube. Oh my gosh. That is so sick. Acquired by killing a boss. I like that. You can only get those by killing certain bosses. That's actually really cool. Uh, the noob archer, business cat. Which one should I buy? I kind of want to get otherworldly. Okay, so these are for codes. And that ant's parrot is actually for ant, I think, the YouTuber. Um, I want a pet in this game. Yo, hit me up if you want to, you know, work on something. Yo, get me a little pet in the game. That'd be pretty sick. All right, let's see. <gasps> Yes, we have ourselves a Dominus pet. Yo, that is actually sick. I can't see him if I'm in first person. Come back, come back, you Dominus pet. <laughs> I wonder what that pets do. Do they do anything? I honestly have no idea. This is groups, this is Twitter codes, and this is just uh, purchasing. I don't know if the pets actually do anything. This is the boss log, that, that. Yeah, I don't think pets do anything. I think they're just accessories. So that would be another cool thing in the revamp. If the pets actually do something, that would be pretty cool. Adding a ton of just rarity of pets, different tiers, and maybe even some YouTuber pets or YouTuber weapons. I'd be totally down. <gasps> what the heck is that, bro? What is this? What is happening? What is this? Is this what my pet does? I think this is my pet's power. Okay, so I was wrong. Maybe pets do something after all. Let me see if that happens again. If it does, then that means it was my pet that did it. I have no idea what just happened. There was a purple orb of confusion. I don't want to join your group. I don't know you like that. I'm not going to join that. I want to see if my pet was doing that otherworldly thing because he is an otherworldly pet. So, I mean, I'm, I'm not really sure. I honestly don't know if that was my Dominus pet or not. Let me know if that was down in the comments. I, it probably was, but I have no idea what it was doing. I think it was just destroying and plowing snow that was in that radius. There it is. It happened again. Yeah, it's gotta be my pet, I'm assuming because it happens like in my trails, but it doesn't look like it's destroying any of the snow. I honestly don't know what it does. I just think it's pretty cool. I don't even know. All right, let's go ahead and sell uh, what we currently have. What's this? That just slows us down, I think. Okay, chill, big plow. Bro, this dude was about to hit me. Oh, uh, do I have the unlimited snow thing on or something? I don't even know if I do. Let me go ahead and sell and see how much I make for this because I don't have uh, too much money right now. Yo, snowman, I'm about to sell my snow. Is that okay? Sell snow. It's, uh, it's not letting me sell. I'm not really sure what's going on here. Why won't it let me sell? Why will it let this guy's... Okay, big plow. Can you move, please? Can... Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm trying... I... I... <sighs> okay, you know what? We're just ditching this guy. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and go get our snowmobile so that we can go to the ice area, the ice mountain, because that is an exclusive area. You can only get there if you have yourselves the snowmobile. And I do have that. So let's make our way over there and uh, check out the Ice Mountain again. Spawning in the snowmobile and we're gonna go ahead and get this thing and revisit Ice Mountain. Now, 
I gotta clarify again, guys, this is a revisit of an old simulator. This game is very old, but they are getting a revamp. That's why I wanted to hop in, remind you guys of it, because it's coming. Whenever this update comes out, I am going to play it because it's gonna be sick. I'm honestly super excited. I need to get better at this game too. I don't have many like good things in this game. Oh, there he is. There's that orb. Yo, this is sick. I think it is happening for my pet. I don't know what it does though. Like, it, like what does this do? What does this mean? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna ride this snowmobile up the mountain and uh, I wanna see how you can actually defeat the boss. The only thing is all I have is a kitchen knife. So <laughs> can't really do much with this except cut, you know, cheese or something. Uh, not fart, but actually cut cheese. What's this guy doing? Hey, mountain guide. Looks like you're down to your knees, literally. What's up, man? Welcome to the Ice Mountain Base Camp. Are you trekking your way up there? Yes. You better be careful. The ridges are very steep. You'll need a snowmobile. Hey, I have one. Thanks, bye. <laughs> Does he want to sell me one? Okay, chill, snowmobile. <laughs> That thing was spinning around. Okay, so I remember that you can collect ice on this area as well, ice in this ice mountain, and then you could collect snow in that other area. So they were the first game to kind of like introduce two different like collectible currencies that you could put in a backpack and then sell. I don't think any other simulator game really popularized this idea of like collecting something in a backpack, your number goes up, it fills up, and then you sell it, and then you can get better backpacks and stuff like that. I. I can't recall a game that really took off with that style. If I'm wrong and this wasn't first, let me know. But I think this was like at least one of the first games to do that style. So I'm really excited again to see how they reinvent themselves. Oh my gosh, what if I just fell off the mountain? I hope that there's a ton of new builds and uh, just new pets, new everything. I don't know, I'm hoping they cover everything because it seems like they've been working on this update for a while. Let me know what you guys want in this new update and what you're expecting down in the comments. Maybe the owner will watch it and uh, put us as a pet in the game. That'd be pretty sick. Also, maybe they'll go through the comments and see what you guys want in the game and uh, last second add stuff. But again, I'll let you guys know exactly when I know this is coming out and I'll have a video up as soon as I see that update right away. You guys better make sure of it. By the way, we got some dope stuff happening this weekend with a bunch of new simulator games, not new ones, but like pet simulators get an update. I think bubblegum simulators getting an update. So there's a lot of stuff happening this weekend. And it's not only pet simulator and bubblegum simulator, which again, I don't know for sure if bubblegum sim is, but pet sim is updating and apparently it's a big one. So I'm excited for that because pet sim hasn't had a big update in a while, but bubblegum sim and uh, ice cream simulator might have another update. Guys, you don't understand how hard the ice cream sim guy works. Like, he's updating the game every day. It's literally insane. But I think what I'm gonna do here is wrap up this video. We pretty much covered everything that's already in this game and I re revisited it and it's pretty nostalgic, but um, this update is not here yet. So once it is, we will go back in this game. Let me know if you guys are hyped with a like, like down below. I'm super excited. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, ding, to never miss an upload. I am pumped. Go check out the Blue Crew merch in Roblox by joining the Blue Crew Roblox group and click that link for some hot IRL merch. The link that's next to the word merch. That's, that's my merch, but it's honestly fire. It's great quality. This is not the merch, but it's sick. It's like really good quality. I actually wear it every day. All of mine are smelly and dirty because I wear it so much, but oh, there's look, there's my pet. What is he like pooping or something? Uh, that's how my pet poops. I don't, <laughs> I don't really know. Alrighty guys, well, I think I'll wrap it up here again. I'll see you guys next time. Two videos a day. Don't miss it and join the blue crew today. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy and outro.